Hey everybody, welcome to Northern Land Tries Ida, or Ida, maybe, I'm not sure, we'll figure it out throughout the game. Um, this is a recently released, it actually came out back in April, but I missed it to be honest, uh, bullet hell boss rush style game, uh, and, and what more do you need to know? I, I can get down with the bullet hell, I can get down with the boss rush, and games, eh, take them or leave them. Um, we, the, step one is the most difficult challenge of all, how, how does one select a safe slot? Space, Q, enter, left click, right click, Q, E, E, of course, it's E, that's my bad, E is, of, it, I'm used to the, your call of duties where you're pressing the F button, uh, and hopefully, you know, all the aim training that I've been doing will help me out in this game as well, I did receive a code from this from the developer way back in April, thank you, and also I'm sorry it took me this long to check it out. It resurfaced for me because I was on uh, Steam Labs, which recommends games based on your you know, collection and what you've played recently and that, you know, it uses the metadata like the tags and the genre and stuff like that in order to uh, figure out what to recommend to you. And it recommended this to me and I went, hey, that sounds familiar. And uh, it turns out I had indeed received an email about it in the past. That's me. Yo, we got a killer soundtrack already. Why does my head hurt so badly? What? What happened? Father? Brother? Koki? What is Koki like your stepmom? You know, she doesn't have a relationship? Is that no, it was the animal. Now I feel bad. Is this a dream? I don't recognize this place. Wait, where's mother? See, if you if I had just read that earlier, it would have been okay, but I am a I'm a fool. Hello! Oh dear, this is a mess, isn't it? You're not the only one who you're not the one who summoned me, are you? Must have been one of the dead ones then. Hmm, not the old one. Not the young one either. Oh, it was the little guy. Hello. Look how adorable I am. I've got a cute little tail and everything. Alright, so should we head out to find your mother? Who are you? My apologies, I'm your new astral guardian. And as your astral guardian, I think we should go find your mother. Though you'll need a weapon out there. Hmm, let's see. Oh, here we go. We'll use your father's revolver. Phew. That spirit transformation took a lot out of me. I don't think I can do that again. Alright, I am... I am ready to move on. Very cute and great aesthetic so far. Hello, birds. Where are we going? We got no ammo. Or rather, we have unlimited ammo. Hmm, that switch is a little too high for you to reach. Maybe try shooting it? Why didn't I think of that? Very kind of Titan Souls-y to begin with here, just with the the way the game looks, the shader, and so on. Little Super Brothers-y too. But it, it, I can't deny that it looks extremely gorgeous. Hello. Hmm. Oh, hello. It is around that time, isn't it? Another new face in the garden. Though you seem a bit different. Different? Yes, quite different. Nonetheless, I won't impede your process any longer. We all know what you're here to do. What I'm here to do? Such an inquisitive child. Unfortunately, I have no time to explain. Your first test awaits you at the top of the hill. Best move along now. Okay. Oh, you see that little creature? That's a spirit collector. Little things just wander around picking up stray spirit. Talent tainted spirits. These spirits will not replenish if lost before death. These spirits will not replenish if lost before death. Hello? Alright, you're cool. It's video game logic. If, if shooting you with a gun doesn't perturb you, then you must be friendly. Alright, take me in. Well? <laughs> do we have a, a dodge roll? We do have a dodge roll, okay. Yikes. And, uh, I don't know, this one's like a little... Ah! This one we can shoot. So crimson things can be shot. Step one. Hello, large creature. Oh, you're not cool! Uh, this is one of those videos where I can already tell people are gonna be like, THE BIT RATE! Which is maybe, you know, it's fair. 
bit rate might be suffering a little bit. Look at this. You would never know that I'm actually a bad gamer based on my performance in this tutorial. Again, I, I've only met one ooh, ooh, tutorial capable of stopping me. And it was Barn Finders. As long as your game is not Barn Finders, that one's my bad. As long as your game is not Barn Finders, I cannot be stopped. Alright, you can also hold down the mouse button, uh, which will save your mouse probably like 10 years of its lifespan instead of clicking each individual shot. Are you proud of me, Papa? Ah, so we gotta fill up every single one of those. Wow, did you see its spirit? It's been a long time since I've seen a spirit implode. I killed that thing. To be fair, it attacked you. Well, while true, <laughs> we did kind of seek it out. Oh, here we go. hold on, hold on. My uh, my Nvidia taskbar popped up and has now screwed up uh, my movement. So if you'll excuse me, I'm gonna restart the game uh, from zero. Thank you. Uh, NVIDIA taskbar. I really appreciate it. I'm sure the developer and publisher of Ida appreciates it as well. And so every time I launch a game now, there's like 20 different things pop up. NVIDIA is like, I want to capture this. And Microsoft is like, you want to talk to some people about this game on your uh, Microsoft page? And I'm like, no, that's okay. And then uh, Battle.net is like, there's 20 people looking for a group right now. And I'm like, I don't believe that that's true. I believe that there's probably 20,000 people looking for a group right now. Just let, just let me go back to the harken back to the days of PC gaming. Where all you had to do to play a game was buy a, an expensive piece of equipment, including a, a three and a half inch floppy disk drive, and then go to the store, and then you would buy the game, and it would be on like nine floppy disks. We allowed to go in here? We're not. Um, and then you'd install them one by one by learning how to use the uh, the DOS command prompt. And it was just that easy. Everything just worked. So I know I'm going uh, in circles here, but just work with me. Mechanics? My strong suit. Exploration? Oh. Very much not my strong suit. Yeah, yeah, here we go. No, wait, this is the way we... No, 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 no. This is right. This is right. Oh, hello. Ah, a child. It's been quite some time since I've seen anyone new here, let alone a child. Hmm, interesting. You're quite the spirit vessel, aren't you? I can feel your spirit, but also others. Spirit vessel? Ah, yes, yeah, sorry. Lonely spirits are drawn to you. They find solace within your aura. I'm also a vessel, unfortunately. Unfortunately? Hmm, oh yes. Well, we vessels tend towards self-destruction. With so many spirits attaching themselves to us, it's easy to lose your sense of self. Oh, also, if you come across any stray sheep, let me know. They've been disappearing in the night for a few weeks now. Can I... I had to check. Alright, so I, I cannot cross this gorge. What about... Uh, what about this thing? I, I see something moving in there. Oh, you know what? There's another entrance right here. My mistake. My mistake. We should go into doors. Why, why am I so hesitant to go into a door? Let's see what you got going on here. Getting a very kind of like... And, and you're going to laugh because this is the comparison that when you compare games to the, this game, everybody laughs. But I'm getting a very, um, along with Titan Souls, which is it's wearing its inspiration on its sleeve without a doubt. Um, I'm getting a very kind of Soulsy vibe right here. This like mossed overworld, and in fact, this thing's straight out of Souls right here. I don't think I've ever seen one of those in real life. And now, are you, you being sincere? You've never seen a cart in real life? Not one that looked like it was haunted. Oh boy, another one. You from the movie The Lobster? Don't worry, you'll rot here like the rest of us. What? Go away. I'm telling Dude, it's Crestfallen Warrior. I'm telling you, there's a Souls inspiration here as well. Uh, excuse me? 
we got a new gun. Yo, we have a whole gun wheel. All right, or maybe not. Um, hmm, these maps don't add up. This statue of an old king, its arm is blocking. Oh, a child, what's a child doing here? Regardless, you shouldn't be wandering around here lost. Please take this map. It's not perfect, but it'll do. If you find any old maps, bring them to me. Press M to bring up the map. Okay. Fair enough. What I wouldn't mind is figuring out where our next boss was. Like, for example, through here is an unexplored area. Hey! Uh, yeah, I was gonna say, what's wrong with our cat? <laughs> it was blinking red. I'm happy to see that you're doing well, child. Against my better judgment, I must ask for your help. I'm the last of this garden's original architects. My three peers have long since perished. This was the last chamber we built. Unfortunately, we let pride get the best of us. The statue inside was built as a reflection of our ego, a signature. I was the only one to make it out alive. He seems pretty stoked about it, though. You can't deny it. Honestly, I never thought I would get the chance to bury my friends. I gave up asking your kin for help long ago. My kin? But again, you seem different. Please let me know when it's safe inside. Okay, will do. I'll have you know I've been doing my aim beast training, so I am pretty sure that I can defeat three faces. I am very briefly, and I know you're like, please stop doing this. I'm very briefly going to pull down the music volume, I think, to like a three. Okay. We're okay. Keep moving. I know you're like, use the other gun. I'm trying. I think the time- oh! My mistake. The time to select a different gun was a while ago. I'm thinking maybe we need like, multiple parts or something, because it's not filled in yet. That, that's, that's my only explanation right now. That's the only thing that makes sense to me. Okay. I am on, uh... I'm on my real HP now, which is a scary thought. Lost both of my pseudo-spirit hearts. It's okay, we're almost halfway through the battle. What are you doing there? Oh! <laughs> I love a game with good bosses. I mean, really, that's why Souls work so well in the first place. The bosses are... Well, I mean, except for the bosses that are like 70 basic enemies. The bosses are pretty good in those games. Can I can I hit you? That doesn't really seem to hit you. You are being annoying. I, I bet if we focus, we're okay here. What did I tell you? You're not crushing me. Oh my god! Okay, well, I probably should have rolled, huh? What is just like fighting a bigger monstro? Get over it. Maybe we're supposed to die there. Mm, maybe not. I think we're just supposed to feel bad. Mother. Father. Brother. There you are. For a second I was worried you weren't gonna come back. Did I? Yeah, you died, but I'm alive now? Yeah. Life and death are pretty arbitrary here. Eventually your body degrades so much that you just don't bother with it anymore. When did you lose your body? Well, I don't really remember. All my memories and sense of self were lost as well. I honestly have no clue who I was or what I look like, but now I'm a cute cat, so who cares? <laughs> valid, valid point. Valid point, I suppose. Alright. Were those bodies here last time? I feel like I'm chunking your HP down a little faster now. Maybe it's because I'm not wasting uh, all of my time. Ooh, ooh, ooh let's go. Uh, trying to equip a gun that I don't have yet. That's probably a start. I mean, this is good progress right here. How about you don't do that uh, hand slapping move so much too? That one got me pretty good. Never mind. Here it comes. This guy is no joke. The first boss, which admittedly... Presumably existed... Oh my god, dude. Just to be the tutorial? I thought I was a real genius. 
Now I'm realizing. Confirm not a real genius. I don't even think we need to walk away from the thing, like when it lands. I think it just always lands in the center. So really, I'm making myself look like a, a real fool right now. Just stay away from the center, dude. I also keep mashing R to reload. I lived. I actually flinched. A little spicy, a little spicy, little spicy, dude. Good roll. And then get out. Good, 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 better. This guy, he, he might get us this time. He might get us this time. We're getting him next time. He's, he's got nothing. He's got nothing. I'm glad to see the game bring some real difficulty. Is it safe? Not yet. <laughs> I'm, I'm glad to see it bring some real difficulty. I'm not afraid. I'm ready. Keep, keep it moving. Keep it moving. You gotta, you gotta keep your feet moving in a game like this. Anytime you're staying still, you know, your APM's going down. As your APM goes down, uh, your ability to respond in an appropriate amount. I'm talking like I'm an expert. Really, I have no idea what I'm talking about. Let's be, let's be honest. Just keep moving. I wonder, apart from other guns, I, or other weapons at least, I wonder what uh, upgrades exist in this. Because it, it, I mean, every bone in my body is like, it's a roguelite. Ob oh my lanta, dude, I'm so dumb. I, it's obviously not a roguelite, at least at, at present there's nothing to tell us that. You can just, yeah, just move out of the way of that one, there you go. How about this one? We're safe. And then don't stand in the center. There you go. Just don't recover in the center. We're safe at the top. Then you don't recover in the center. But I'm interested to see what other, like, uh, spectrums for improvement there are in the game. You know, if we can get a little faster, for example. That, that would help out. You're not gonna hit me. Alright. I mean, now we're making this boss look like a joke. No, 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 no. The sound, dude. It's alright. Just keep chunking it. <laughs> oh. You're doing, you're doing great, sweetie. Just keep it up. Good good rolls, boys. Good rolls. You have to be kidding me. We were like... I really thought we were... I mean, we were playing chicken at the end, but I really thought that was it. All right. We got this one locked down. I promise. Sorry, I almost walked out again. <laughs> we got this one locked down. Honestly, if I could just keep myself out of the freaking center when the enemy is respawning, we got nothing to worry about. Good moves, good moves. And then out of the center, and thankfully that dodge roll has a big window. It's a lot like, a, you know, like a minimalist, like, enter the gungeon meets Titan Souls right here. I'm so used to the the monstro muscle memory of like when he disappears he's gonna come back and land on top of me incredible roll brother incredible roll incredible roll and then you stay out of the center this is the best it's the best fight so far we're approaching true mastery you're half dead this could all go wrong in the blink of an eye. So just be cool. Oh, these are the bodies of the two dead other scientists who created this thing. It's world building. I get it. Okay, we're fine. I'm gonna promise you this is like, is harder than it looks. Maybe not for everybody, but for me. This represents a serious test of skill and will. 
Good timing on the... And if this is boss 2, then this whole game is, uh... Is about to get mighty difficult, brother! Just... No! Just stay out of it, dude! I know, you're like, how did he not get hit? How are you not dead? Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, I'm so exhilarated. How did we do it? How did we do it? You madman. You made it? Honestly, I can't believe you're alive. Everyone who entered before, they all died, but you're... I'm different. What do you mean by that? You arrived through the Void Gate, correct? The cave with the Mountain of Eyes? I think so. That's the Void Gate. Most perish on the trip over. The ones who don't, well, they eventually find death as well. Thank you, Ita. I can give you my old friends... Or I can give my old friends a proper burial now. Wait, I need to know. What's the Void Gate? I'll be honest, I don't completely know. Some sort of connection, a doorway from other planes to this one. Can I use it to get back, to go home? I don't see why not. I'm not sure anyone has attempted it, though. Anytime a traveler arrives, the Void Gate's eyes glow with spirit. The Void Gate clearly wasn't meant to be used at our discretion. I assume you'll need to imbue that spirit through the force, though. Through force, though. Unfortunately, that's the extent of my knowledge. I'm sorry I can't be of more help, Ita. This seems really cool. Uh, there is nothing more mechanics-driven, and you know I'm a, me I'm a mechanics guy above all else. There's nothing more mechanics-driven than, um... A boss rush game and this one uh, it seems to strike a really good level of difficulty as well uh, even, even in the very early game here I I'm, I'm having a very good time so I am gonna cut the video here this is available um, on Steam I don't know what I did there maybe it's a checkpoint um, this is available on Steam you know what let's let's let you enjoy the ambiance for a moment there it's uh, 15 bucks American and if you enjoy Titan Souls, if you haven't played Titan Souls, you should also play Titan Souls. It's got a real, you know, kindred spirits thing going on with this. Um, if you enjoy Titan Souls, if you enjoy games like Fury and stuff like that, I would encourage you to give this a try. A, a twin stick shooter that is not a roguelite. What a world. For now, thanks for watching. I hope you guys have enjoyed the episode. Please do check out the game on Steam, even if you don't want to pick it up right now. If you enjoyed what you saw, you can add it to your Steam wishlist for free and be notified of when it goes on sale, which I'm sure the developer would appreciate. Apart from that, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, please do click the like button. It's the single best way to help me out as a content creator on YouTube, and it's completely free as well, so please do click the button if you enjoyed the video. Apart from that, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. See ya!